Today we're going to the Park MGM. It's an old favorite. It used to be the Monte Carlo. Today we'll be staying in a Nightingale suite. It's one of those large rooms right by the elevator. Years ago we used to walk past them and say, someday we're going to stay in one of those. We didn't think it would be two decades, but here we are. As soon as you walk in, you have a closet on your right and a bar on your left. The bar has a, a mini sink and your mini bar snacks. A large entry into a very large room. The room looks even bigger because it's not square or rectangle. It's uh, kind of odd shaped, but it makes it look even bigger. It is a very nice sized room. It has two queen beds. They're joined by a single headboard with a nightstand that has a Bluetooth speaker and a couple of night lights. It also has outlets and charging ports. And in the center of the room is a very soft red leather couch. The dinette set has two very comfortable leather chairs. A nice place to have a private meal. The long red couch by the window is a great perch for watching the beautiful sunrise or sunsets over Vegas. The room is well lit, it has plenty of lights, including two very interesting lights that are mounted to the sides of the full length mirror. It has a doorway that uh, leads to an optional adjoining room. And then there's a very large bathroom. It has a large mirror with one sink and lots of counter space. There is no bathtub, but there is a very large walk-in shower. I love that bold red tile. And the shower has really good water pressure. The bathroom also has a separate water closet for privacy. Overall, we were very comfortable with this room. No complaints at all. Even though it's right near the elevator, we didn't hear any noise from the hallway. We recommend checking this room out. We really enjoyed staying at Park MGM. It's a very good location, especially if you're planning to attend an event at the T-Mobile Arena, or if you just like eating at Italy. There are so many good food choices at Italy, and drink choices also. And that completes our stay at the Nightingale Suite at Park MGM. Hope you enjoyed it. If you're not subscribed, please do that. It really does help our channel. And hit that notification bell so you'll know when we put up more room and restaurant reviews.